Class 5 IMO Level 2 Recap and Tips for Success Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Make sure to subscribe, hit that like button and turn on post notifications so that you guys never miss out on a video that I upload. Today, we are going to check out Recap and Tips for Success. In this question, they have asked to first round off the decimal numbers and then find the difference. But in this question, they have asked to first find the difference and then round off. In this question, they have asked to first round off and then find the sum. So you all have to be careful whether they have asked to round off first or find the difference sum or product. In this question, they have said that Pankaj runs around the track twice. Instead of finding only the perimeter, we need to find twice of that because Pankaj runs around the track twice. Be careful if they have asked twice, thrice or once. Also, so be careful if there is none of these or all of these. In this question, here they have asked incorrect. Please check if it's incorrect or correct. Similarly, in this question, they would have ask shaded option but they have asked unshaded you have to be careful whether they have asked shaded or unshaded portion in this question they have said four tenths and twelve tenths not tenths but twelve tenths so you should be careful whether it's tenths tenths hundreds or hundreds in this question they are asking how many sixths are there not six six one by six in this question, they are asking how many are equal to three right angles. Not one, but not two, but three right angles. So we have to find 270 degree, not 90 degree. Here they have asked one by two of remaining money on the foot. So you should be careful with is it remaining or from the total. Next question. In this, they have asked to find the sum. While adding, subtracting, multiplying or dividing, you need to make sure that the places are written properly. Ones is written on the ones, tens is written on the tens and hundreds is written on the hundreds. In this question, they have asked to find the area. In order to find the area, we need to find the missing lengths and breadths. But don't get carried away thinking that they have asked to find the perimeter. So in order to find the area, we need to divide the figure into rectangles and squares. Similarly, in this, they have asked the area of the given figure. In this, we can divide these as squares and rectangles. Here, they have asked minimum number of squares that must be added in the figure. Not shaded, not unshaded, but added in the figure. So, you should be careful whether they have asked added, unshaded or shaded. Here, a person can paint a wall in 45 minutes. How many walls such can he paint in 9 hours? They have given in 45 minutes, but they are asking for 9 hours. So, in order to do this, we, you have to divide. But, dividing, you should make sure that all these are in the same unit. Because in order to divide, multiply, play, add or subtract, everything must be in the same units. Here, they are saying that if a carpet is laid, leaving a border of 1 meter all around it. So, you just shouldn't subtract 1 meter from the perimeter. But you should subtract all around it, which means you should subtract 2 from the length and 2 from the breadth. Be careful about this. I hope you all do well and all the best for your success. I'll be cheering you on from here. So, as always, that's it for this video. Make sure you subscribe, hit that like button and turn on post notifications so that you guys never miss out on a video that I upload. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.